Hi, I'm Victoria Delano, and this is our Why Story. My 12-year-old son's name is James, and he has a couple of rare conditions. One is called mitochondrial disease, where the cells in his body don't make enough energy to keep his muscles and organs functioning properly. He also is a survivor of hemophagocytic lymphohistiocytosis, a very rare bone marrow disease that nearly took his life in 2016. In August of 2016, James was in a coma in the ICU in multi-organ failure. He fought really hard and survived and it took him months, but he regained his strength. Last summer, one of his doctors recommended he start on an exercise program, so we came into the Y looking for a specific machine that he could get on that his doctor had recommended, and we saw Cindy Reams. Cindy um, guided us to the proper machine, and she talked to us about getting him in with a personal trainer. She also talked with us about applying for a scholarship so not only would help us financially be able to make this possible, but also to hold us accountable so James would have somebody to work with who would um, keep him coming and keep him wanting to come here. James's cardiologist, who we actually travel to Toledo, Ohio for this specialist, um, he said that he's gonna have James through his adulthood because he sees pediatric patients and adult patients and that he didn't want to be stuck with the problems that all the pediatricians create in James's body from all of his treatments. He wants to make sure that he gets through all of his treatments strong as he possibly can. So he recommended a specific machine for James to get on for cardio work and he also recommended weight-bearing exercises which he's been working with a personal trainer to learn. So I talked to Cindy and we applied for a scholarship and it's been really helpful because um, not only financially the cost of having a um, very seriously ill child um, is pretty overwhelming, but also having the community of the YMCA and the people here to hold us accountable and have that on our schedule that we are here and we have an appointment to be here and he has somebody he's meeting to work with him on the exercises just makes it, um, I think, more important in all of our minds that we, we value that time a lot more. Um, because we feel like we're committed and the Y is committed to getting him stronger. The Y has really become a family to James. It's made him feel like he's valued and he's important and like his health matters to people and I want to thank all of the donors and the volunteers for making this possible for him.